you can't come in my life and decide what I have to do to just please you. No, 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 no. Si bono gusta, then doi, ayo. Kue bobolchi nang bobay. Hello? Ta papa? Papa, ta mi talisha. Komi borito saban. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for tuning in once again. I have my hat in this hat wrap because I just finished um, washing my hair. I did a wash and go. So later on when we're ready, I'm going to get rid of this hat towel and we will be popping, popping, popping. When I always take a bath, I like to um, use a lotion, a body lotion to um, moisture my skin because I have really dry skin so I'm using this Palmer body lotion is the coconut oil of course go go coconut you know it's a must um let me start by saying why do I call myself Coco so um okay the name came because mm. I literally love coconuts. Everything that is related to cocoa, I'm obsessed. Mm. I love the smell, I love the taste, everything. Also, my hair products, my leave-in is cocoa, not something. Mm. My body lotion, as you already saw. I have also a lip balm that's coconut. I have many mm. things that is coconut related. I'm really, really obsessed with coconuts from food to whatever that has coconut in it you sold me <laughs> so yes um that's how the name coco came and right now it's really a thing that you guys really call me coco but it's so fascinating to see that you know my coco fam is growing day by day and you guys really appreciate what i do and you guys really enjoy my channel i also have like guys that watch, watch my channel literally i'm like oh wow so, oh wow so my coco fam i have guys of course my friendly lady is i also have coco babies like this is so so cute love my coco fam so so much um first thing first i really want to say sorry for the last vlogmas that i didn't upload i wasn't feeling myself mm. lately um let's start um today i don't know yet where i'm going mm. but i think i'm just going for a chill have a drink thing going on today sorry that sometimes mm. i keep looking over the camera because i have my big mirror behind me and i also will be using mm. this to do my makeup because sis only brought this thing with me to use for makeup and i only have my basic things in here i hope let's chit chat chit chat a little bit um one topic for sure that i want to um have right now is you know the year is ending mm. christmas just passed so that means that before we know it we will be in 2021 and mm. we all know that this year this year was a motherfucker but we have to look beyond all the bad things and look also for the good things that we have brought for all of us all right so i did my brows off camera because the mirror is behind the camera but it's way behind the camera so i really had to get close so i can see better um all i did was just you know shave my brows fill them a little bit in and use my concealer i use um the la girl concealer this one in cool tan and that was it i'm going to use the becca set and refresh powder the hydro mist 
this one um just to you know get away some of the oil out of my face and then i'm just going to carve my face better contour it a little bit and then you're done for the face lily that was it for the face So yes, it's really good to you know just reflect sometimes and see how life is treating you and also focus on, on your blessing. If you only focus on the negative things, you won't see the positive things that also life brings your way and also you won't focus on the lessons that life taught you. And then you will have to just keep repeating the same mistakes all over and over again. And let me tell you, you really don't want to do that because me, I'm a boss in doing that. And after that, I'm like, why does this keep, keep, why does this thing keep happening to me? Blah, blah, blah. But if I look back, I just allowed it to keep happening once and all over again. Just because I accepted it and I didn't learn from my lessons before, you know? So that is why it's really important to just reflect every year or every month and see what happened this month. What has this month um, learned me? What did I learn? What can I better of myself, you know? And if you do all those things, eh, you will be getting rid of toxic persons and everything negative energy you will catch up really quick on that like and let me tell you like let me tell you i was um getting along with people that had so much bad energy on myself that um right now when i feel that 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 vibe i'm like na 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 do this bye bye do it this ain't it Right now, I'm just using my NYX contour palette. You just contour it just a little bit, nothing much. You barely can see it. I can see it barely, but yeah, I'm looking in my camera right now <laughs> to see what I'm doing. But yes, as I was saying, it's really, really important to catch up on bad vibes really or in an early stage because if you can't catch up on that then you will be fucked and fucked all over again i'm talking to this person and like he's not a bad person at all lily is not a bad person at all but we don't get along at all and i'm like na 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 and it's not even that you know that thing of a, let's say it's not even that special because the person is really just a friend and uh, i don't need that type of thing in my life you know my life is really good to be always looking only on the negative things or for you to talk down on me no let me talk down on myself and better myself but i don't need you to come for me and tell me i don't like you for i don't like this of you i don't it hey not me a flaga like not a interesami kubono gusta me kubono gusta me as equipo si bono gusta then do it ayo huevo bolchi nang bobai paso min quien te botene a mi si burro no te botene so um like if someone keeps triggering you and you feel it, get rid of that person. Because if you keep hanging on to that person, oh my gosh, you will be in the negative zone really quick. And you'll be like, why is my life even going the way that I want? Because you keep hanging with person that you're not supposed to hang with. Get rid of those persons. If they tell you, hey, I don't like you for to doing this, especially if 
if you have a boyfriend and he keeps telling you no i don't like you to do this blah 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 i don't like this no then sir from the first start you saw that i'm like that you can't come in my life and decide what i have to do to just please you no 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 you just have to accept me how i am and for also wearing what i want doing whatever i want of course there are some things that you know we can discuss to better because you know sometimes we do some things that we usually um are okay with doing but if someone talks to us and say you know what this thing this thing this thing and comes with literally good facts then you'll be like you know what i think um you're right i'm going to better this of myself but not for example if i post a pic in bikini and all those times i love bikini and i post my pics in bikinis and now that you're in my life you'll be like no i don't like you to post pics in bikini anymore no 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 no. or um if i have a friend and you'll be like i don't want you to be friends with that person can you explain why and that person can explain why Bye. bye bye so really really protect protect your aura you know stay in your bubble don't let nobody pop your butt bubble also one thing if you have a gut feeling about someone trust that gut feeling because if you ignore it oh my gosh if you ignore it you will be really devastated at the end because that gut feeling 99% was correct most of the time when we meet someone and we be like um yes i really like this person you guys go on a date blah 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 blah, blah, blah. and ping first red flag and because you really like that person you just ignore the red flag second red flag and you keep ignoring if you ignore the first red flag you will keep ignoring the rest of the red flags and before you know it few months later you will be heartbroken crying months and you don't know why so protect your aura please 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 but let's go back to 2020. It has been a, a year that you'll be like, wow, damn. It has really harsh on many of us financially and emotionally. But we're here, we're in December and God didn't woke you up every day from the 1st of January till 31 of December just to be like, okay, I just made it to 2020. Let's see what 2021 brings. No you have to write down what you want to achieve for 2020 and put that into action go for it go for it i want to see all of my coco fam succeed like especially me of course i have some goals already set for 2021 keep it for yourself and go for it when you're there then you'll be like you know i'm here yes sorry for hiding it but i really have to do this for myself so set your goals for 2021 and go for it. Um, I know some, some of you guys are religious, then, then this doesn't apply to you. But if you are, first thing, put God first. Um, start by praying. Start by accepting Him in your life. I think um, it was in... I think it was in May. Yes, it was in May. In May, I literally accepted god in my life the one thing that i sh really said for sure every day when i woke up just pray mm. before going through my phone it doesn't even matter if my phone is ringing everybody is messaging me no it doesn't bother me i just be in my zone talk with god first thank him for the day and also talk to him ask him like you know god i'm stressed about this can you help me with this can you make a way for this i know it seems impossible but nothing is impossible with you please i really need to help me with this eventually everything will work out at the best time me i swear i swear last year in 2019 november entering december it was my hardest hardest 
um, time ever in my life. I was really, really depressed, stressed, emotionally um, heartbroken. It was the most heaviest heartbreak ever that I experienced in my whole life. I was crying days by days. I didn't know what to do with my life. I was really done. I was ready to go back to Curacao. Um, I also wasn't um, getting quite there with school. They weren't accepting me because my diploma, they didn't accept that in the Netherlands. Um, I'm going to cry, oh my gosh. Okay, so um, I really want to thank um, my friend, my chicken nuggets, <laughs> because um, I was talking to her every day and I told, I was telling her what I was facing at that timing and uh, she sent me a link that uh, of, a, of a pastor that was preaching about relationship how you should um, get your life together. I think I'll just add that link below. I'll search that and add it below for you guys. And this, this, literally this helped me so much. I cried the whole night. Literally cried the whole night. The day after, I was feeling good. But of course, it took me a few more months to you know, um, accept that life change that I have to move on from all the things that happened. But I really, really feel a, a, a weight off my shoulders, you know? Mm. It's really important to value yourself and know your worth. Go out, do something for yourself that makes you feel better. Mm. Don't stay in that zone for too long or then you will be so pressed and you don't know what to do else with your life. That's why also so many persons that are dealing with depression don't know what to do and they end up suiciding themselves or doing something bad to themselves because they don't have that person to talk to. And one person that you really, really have to talk to, even though you feel like he doesn't respond to you, is God. He literally will get you through it. If I could get through that, like, I'm telling you, it was some heavy, heavy shit. I'm really proud of the person that I'm becoming and how far I came since I accepted God in my life. Since I accepted Him, I wasn't accepting bullshit anymore from anybody. I really look who I deal with in my life and who I accept in my life. I really want to... Um, conserve my bubble and stay in, in you know in my zone in my positive zone my life is too amazing i'm too blessed i'm literally the most beautiful person ever to be in the negative zone i don't want to fight with the devil no i want to be you know i'm the angel bitch second reflect on everything all the bad things and you will see also the good things and you will you will get all the good things out of the bad things especially for your relationship i've been doing this for a long time already a long period of time mm. when i was dealing with someone if i was chilling with someone or i was in a relationship with someone and it didn't work out i always mm. reflect and get well, okay what did i learn out of this what did it taught me what is the message behind this mm. How can I um, better myself after this? And eventually all those, those mm. things um, made me the person that I am today. But I literally hope that you guys um, keep this true in mind and also understand what I'm trying to say. Yes, yeah, so I just apply mascara. Um, and also I put on this bodysuit. It's not a full bodysuit. It's a the short bodysuit. I'll show you guys in a second in a big mirror. Um, right now I'm just going to get my hair out of this towel so we can see what we are working with. For gel, I use this gel. It's the extreme gel. This one. 
and for edge control I use the Film of Nature Coconut Milk Shine and Hold Control Glue Coco represent again <laughs> I have some heat, 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 some, um, when I bleach them, I have some damage, but I'll be, I've been using Olaplex and it's working wonders with my hair and we will see when it gets longer, maybe I'll just cut off the, um, the other blonde parts, loving it. For sure, I will be getting a puppy today because. <laughs> and yes, we are ready. <laughs> we are ready to run those streets. Ready to go. Okay, let's go. I'm going to put on my um, wear my bag, show you guys the outfit, and then we'll be on the road. Let's go. Here I am, know it's been 